All right, I'm Caitlin Graber, this is Kenny, my Aaron, and our topic is the effects of the recession on the United States. All right. um, the topics we'll talk about is the housing market, the automobile industry, small business, and government spending. First, I'll talk about the effects of the recession on the housing industry. The housing industry has taken blame for most of the current economic situation. Um, most of this is due to subprime loans, which are the riskiest types of loans that are financed to bad credit borrowers. And there were two main causes that led to the housing crisis. The first major crisis or major blow can be attributed to sub these subprime loans. As I mentioned before, they're the high risk loans. Um, these irresponsible financing practices resulted in nationwide defaults and foreclosures. Also, as more loans were approved, home builders began building more and more homes that eventually exceeded the demand, which drove down home prices nationwide. And as prices dropped, so did debt growth. The next major blow to the industry is the steady rise in unemployment. Consumers cut back on spending, especially on large business or er, investments such as houses, due to fear of losing jobs, decreasing home value, and defaulting on their loans. This problem is consistent with other recessions of the past because it will only correct itself once employment, unemployment rate levels rise. As mentioned before, the subprime loans and high interest <coughs> rates caused foreclosures, defaults, and depreciation rates to soar. Foreclosures have broken records for the last three decades, and many homes are selling for as low as 30% less than their regular value. And as it, foreclosure rates in, increase, the nearby homeowners are also losing home equity. This graph here shows the foreclosure activity in home prices from 2006 to 2008. Um, the dotted line represents um, the National Home Price Index, which has obviously decreased significantly. And the purple bars represent the U.S. properties with foreclosure filings, which is almost triple in 2008 than what it was in 2006. 